Hello and welcome once again to Treasure Hunt, the show where our contestants have to grapple with five cryptic clues to hopefully find our treasure and win up to £2,000 for themselves. Now, all week we've been in the historic setting of Broom Park in Kent, which was once owned by Lord Kitchener, who, before the First World War, inscribed his motto above the uh, fireplace there and in typical military fashion. It was just one word, thorough. And thorough is what our contestants today are going to have to be if they're going to win this prize of £2,000. And they are Neil Gregory. Hi. And Daniel Parker. Hi, <laughs> Hello to you both. Now, where do you come from? We, well, we both live in Edinburgh. And we're curators of um, architectural drawings at the Royal Commission on the Ancient and Historic Monuments of Scotland. It's quite a mouthful. It sounds <laughs> like an interesting job, though. Uh, do you think any of the skills involved in it will stand you in good stead today? We do a bit of map reading and um, a little bit about... Uh, architecture and archaeology so well, well I can tell you there's plenty of map reading going on in this <laughs> could be possibly destructive to our careers <laughs> <laughs> now Susie where are you today well I'll give you a little clue do you remember that book written by Francis Hodgson Burnett the secret garden oh yeah seen the yes. film <laughs> do you remember that yep yeah. Well, I'm in the Secret, in the Secret Garden. Garden. Oh, wow. It's at Great Maytham Hall. Now, Frances used to live in this hall back in 1898, and she was a really keen gardener, but she was very, very frustrated because she couldn't find her way into the garden. There was no way in. Until one day, she watched a little robin feeding its young, and she took a closer look, and as she took a closer look, she saw this. Now, I don't know if we can just see just behind this tree here, the shape of a door, and that was the only way into the garden. So, Dermot, Daniel and Neil, that's where I am. Great Maytham Hall. Can you find me on the map? Okay, yes, we're going to turn the light okay. on on our map here. Great Maytham Hall. And a little robin isn't here to help Let's us, I'm afraid. Let's uh, uh, Great Maytham Hall should be just... Um, yes. Near a village called Rolvenden. Rolvenden. There's Rolvenden. Can you see a slightly okay. south of there? We've got okay. you. The right. Great Maiden, we've got you. Great Maiden Hall. We found you, Susie. Excellent. Right, OK, let's start with the first clue. Should we start the clock? Yes. Great. Here we go. North, your forbidden den to Isaiah's fifth opening. Make some toast, but where's the sweet in case? OK, North, your forbidden den to right. Isaiah's fifth opening. Well, Make some toast, but where's the one, sweet in case? Sounds... What Very to do cryptic with to me. Yeah, we'll God. make our way back to the helicopter. Into the helicopter okay, yeah. if you'd get up in the helicopter. And uh, then we'll get going, not to waste any time. Excellent. Yes. We'll try and find out which direction to send you. Now, any ideas here? North, your. Very well tended garden. Hello well, there. Doing a fantastic job. Den might be. And uh, the out to the main yeah. part of the garden. Yeah, the name of Hello. the village. Hello. There's the hall. Look, great, made them hall. So we started going north. That might be. That's yeah. a great idea. Let's go north. North gradually. You head oh, north, Susie. Hello, mm. Hello Keith. Let's have a look. Where are we again? Here we are. Great Maiden. We're just, no, no. just there, yep. How far north? So, north, you're forbidden. What about Biddenden? There we Bidenden. are. Biddenden, right, that sounds great. We're just about Very to take yeah, heading, off, Dermot. Yeah, Susie, we're heading to Biddenden. Dermot, which way do you want us to go? Biddenden, due north. From due where north, you are. due north, yeah. We found a town called Biddenden. Now, what about this Bindon, Isaiah's fifth opening? Uh, is that a biblical? It, like does, sound, to me. it does sound like a biblical it's reference. Show. Right, we're just Bindon. taking off. We're going to Bindon head due north. No, I, I'm wondering, Bindon. with um, the sweet in the case, um, is that perhaps in a sugar case? Are we going to find it in there? Let's have a look. Have a look. Um, it's on the shelves. Good idea. Give it a shake, open it up. Anything <laughs> in there? <laughs> Maybe not the time for it yet. Oh, I see. It's got a hinge on it. There's nothing inside <laughs> it. Nice idea, Neil, but uh, no luck there. There we go, just leaving Great Maytham Hall behind. Let me sing for my... Why don't we find some more information about Bindon? Have we got anything on yeah, that in our books, books of Kent? Kent. Kent OK, so we're going to go to Bindon. Now, Keith, how far away is Bindon? Tell me. Bindon. 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 I think it's... You'll get it. Um, two, two. I think if these B are each... Bindon. Each a kilometre... I think oh. it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. About eight kilometres. Eight kilometres to north. About five miles, Susan. Five miles. Five miles. That should take us how long, do you think, Keith? Five miles. Five, five minutes. minutes. Why is it always five minutes, Keith? <laughs> you always say that. I think it might be a vineyard. I've got the um, fifth... So am I looking for a vineyard? I, um, it's quite possible. I'm, I've got the fifth chapter of Isaiah here. Can you read it out for us? Did you hear the clue, Susie? I, I did, yes, I did. Um, so it's Isaiah's fifth... Oh, to, um, we're going north to, 
to North Your Forbidden Den to Isaiah's fifth opening. So I'm uh, wondering if that might be the start of the fifth chapter of Isaiah, which says, let me sing for my beloved, my love song concerning his vineyard. So I'm wondering if it might be a vineyard there, Susie. The lovely I, had a vineyard on I a very think that's fertile probably quite a hill. Good idea, isn't because it's it? certainly the opening of the. And it may be a hill. Um, my beloved had a vineyard on a very fertile hill. So, okay, here we have Susie just heading towards Biddenden up there. She's what about um, a third of the way there. Yeah, so, uh, yeah, need about to look a third. Out, I think that could need be to look out for a vineyard. Farm, just down to the side. Okay. Now I've got a little bit relating to the food part of the clue, and. It says, Biddenden's most famous residents were two maids of Biddenden, Eliza and Mary Chulkhurst. And did they have anything to do with uh, vineyards? Where did you find Well, that the food thing? reference is the fact that um, mm. they, um, they were Siamese twins and uh, they um, perpetrated um, in an Easter charity which provided cheese and loaves and it's now called the Bread and Cheese Lands. Right, so Siamese twins, they okay, say. any closer to yeah. exactly where you want me to land? So on Easter Monday, visitors can eat biscuits embossed with images of the maids. Right, so we need to vineyard. find out where that... What, yeah, did they so have maybe some house or in, something? Or? In the I'm vineyard. looking out for vineyards. I think... That, right. Chaps, um, stop right, what you're doing, because I think that this is a vineyard down below me now. Um, I'm, o I'm, I'm just by Clapper Hill. There's a vineyard just right. below Clapper Hill. It, it looks Clapper like I'm Hill. over it. Um, I, I'm, Susie, I've actually just found a, a, a brochure um, on Biddenden Vineyards, and I'm just going to try and... Well, listen, I need to know, guys, if you want me to land or not, because I'm yes, not going to land... Yes, please, if you yes, would. Yes, please, yeah, yes, 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 please. OK, so I'm landing so uh, forceful, just in the brochure, <laughs> just uh, by the vineyard here. I'm just trying to locate your exact location. Can you see the hill? Can you see just south of uh, Biddenden? Don't worry too much about just finding south exactly of the map. If she's okay, there, fine. let's find the that's, information. That's great. And we're just going to... we, We've got on a sky router. Let's hear from the brochure. Let, what, what's it got in there, Daniel? Is there anything there that might help Susie? You can see all the vines growing very strongly here. Where's your little one? Susie? Yes? Make we're just going to we... work, work out the last part of the, the clue here. Make some toast, but where's the sweet in case? So but, I'm you, just... but you definitely want me to land? Yes, please, yes. yes you would. Yes, please, Keith. I think that okay, might... OK, we're just landing now. We're landing literally in the vineyard. On the left-hand side, we can see loads and loads make of vines. Toast. Yeah, you see, I think it's to do with this bread and case. cheese in Biddenden. Um, and there's some, there's some markings on the side here. Thanks, Keith. Toast let's have a look. Yeah, let's yeah, have a look. What make does it a say toast. here? That's Got some true. signs. Where's the sweet... Long walk and short walk. Do they make sweet wine there? That's I'm running down towards the buildings where they obviously uh, make the wine. The varieties planted and um, yes, it could a be a wine. wine. Lots Hello. of lovely Ge ladies picking grapes. Yes, because you would toast a glass of wine, wouldn't you? And mm. wines of Germanic origin um, are often very sweet. So no, then. So toast a glass of wine. Is there Do any you way want you, me to is go? Wine? Is there any way you might make a toast? We think a toast. Or in a, yeah. Right, what have we got down here? So they have any way you taste it or something like that? Vineyard. A shop. We'll go in the wine shop. Perhaps. Should we go in the shop? In the yeah. wine shop would be terrific. Oh, hello. Hang on. There's a wine tasting. No, oh, yes. there's a wine tasting going on here. Oh, excellent. Would you taste? You get all the good jobs. We've got we've got their own ones. We've got the Ortega. Schönberger. Go for right. a German one. Go for a German one. Where's yes. the sweet in case? Oh, can I go for the German? Yes. No, they're sweet all English. Can you, is, is there a case of wine? Is there a case of wine? I'm supposed to be drinking. I'm supposed to be finding a clue. Uh -huh. What are you doing? Want we'll to dip in the shop and see if you can find it? Is there a case of wine? Is there a case of wine? You want to dip for a case of wine? A case of sweet wine. I think it's a German wine. Maybe the Ortiz. A case of sweet German wine. Are you a bit of a wine basket? here. Hello. How are you doing? Fine, thank you. Can I open this box? Yes. I don't know, maybe you can. I did taste the, the wine outside. It's for you to say. It's not your wine. Are you sure you want me to open this box? Yes. Yes, please, please Susie. Please, oh. if you would. Is there a clue Okay, in I'm, I'm trying to open it. <laughs> Let's see if it... She's not the Stop, the the Stop the clock! Stop the clock! Well, 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 well done, chaps. Excellent. It's, it's <laughs> in the Ortega box. In the Ortega was great. That's the one I tasted outside. That's very nice. He knows wines. Is it nice? Um, I'm, I'm not a great fan of sweet wines myself, mm. but... <laughs> well, well done, Susie. Thank you very much indeed. Now, I can tell you, the good news is it's good news all round. You've sold the first clue. You've won £100 altogether. <laughs> and, perhaps even better than that, you're now 50 seconds Woo! in hand here. Oh, great stuff. Oh, so well done to Susie as well. Now, Susie, uh, just remember, we're not stopping the clock again until after clue three. OK. Let's look at that second clue. Can you uh, read it for us and start the clock? 
Here we go, clue two. End of the line for Kez. Ask Harry for Queen Vic's Windsor. Better not be... Ooh. Trick oh. say... <laughs> Better not be... <laughs> that's, that's a fear of, that's a fear of uh, the number 13. Well, well let's, let's read Let that. the newsreader read that. Is that right? <laughs> yeah. 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 End of the line for Kez, or K-E-S... Ask Harry for Queen Vic's Windsor. That's Better good. not be Triskaidekaphobic. Oh, thank you very much for that. I think. <laughs> yeah. I think Bye, guys. Do. See you. Which, which Neil, you think it's is... fear right. of the number 13. Fear of the number 13. We'll head back we... to yeah. uh, the helicopter. Let's get on yeah. with the first line. Yeah. That, that okay. Okay. End of the line. Could that be a railway line? End of the line for K-E-S. End of the line for K-E-S. Let's have a look. I'm looking at railway line. We've got Susie on our sky. Right, then. Let's see what they make of this clue. Just as south of Biddington. We've got a dismantled railway right next to Biddington. Right, dismantled railway. Where's that? That's just here. Keeps ready at the helm, as always. That's the end of it, then. Here we go. K-E-S. Oh, K-E-S. Okay. One anything, second. Anything ending in yeah. K-E-S. Oh, there's a big railway here, of course. Beginning. Thanks, what Keith. Of the line. Got a little gift, uh, look. A little bottle of cider. You like a, a little tot, don't you? Let me see if I can find something. Uh, right, then. Which way, chaps? Uh, okay. uh, what are we looking for? Just a minute. Here's the branch with, line with to Tenterden. To Tenterden. That sounds good. That's One nearby. second, um... Tented and we've, we're looking for a railway line, Susie. We've oh, look, found... KES, that's the, that's the trains, so... And that's KES. I think Neil's cracked mm. it. Yeah. OK. End, end of the line for KES. So we need to find out where we're looking that for a railway, particular line Susie. ended. You can, so um... you want me to go towards Tenterden? Here's another book. Why not have a look at that Do uh, you want me to go near to, towards Tenterden? I, th- I think... What do you think, Daniel? Um, Tenterden it is. Well, here's is that where the railway line heads? Bidden. Where's this disused railway? Right? Think... Yes, here we are. Yes, I see. Yes, if you would head in that direction to start with, and then we'll, we'll try and give you more information. Okay, as we, we're heading towards we there. It. There we go. Yeah. There's everybody. It's it's the KES, the Kent and East Vignos. Sussex Railway. Lovely. Well, so Neil. we need to find out where right, where, where the end of that, that is, and hopefully, oh, here's some time. To... Oh no. So KES is the yes. Kent and East Sussex Railway line. Right. Okay. So we need the. Well, end it sounds of the like we've got to look that. for a, a railway line yeah, when we get to Tenterden. Maybe you'll find a, a like an old you know train timetable in one of these. Is there any other books on on railways at all? Have a look, maybe. And any brochures? Yes. Where are we? Ask um, Kent. What does it say about the Kent and East Sussex railway line, there, Neil? Sorry. What did it say about the, uh, the the old railway line? Um, I haven't found anything yet. I've just found Nothing the page specific. where Bid and Dunn is. Um, well, shall I have a look in one of these Kent so... books? We. I'm not doing very well here. Let's have a look. So, what's the line of thought, Neil, at the moment? The line of thought is we need to follow a railway line and we need to follow it to the end, and I suspect it's an old railway line. Um, now, I've got a train timetable with Biddenden on it. Do you want so, to look up Tenterden, which is where we think it might end? Yeah, it? it's going from London... Tenterden. I've got no Tenterden. So, the either, end so. of the railway line you want? Yeah, yeah, Tenterden, it's, it's sort of... It's a bit with Biddenden. Excellent, so will, yeah. Yeah. And then what, what would I be looking for? What would I be looking for at the end of the line, do you know? Kent and East Sussex Railway here. One, at the moment we're not sure, but it's something one, royal, two, obviously. Um, OK, well, while they're trying to uh, work that bit out, see what's at the end of the railway. What about Headcorn? Uh, Tenston's little station at the end of Station Road is the headquarters of a band of enthusiasts who are working to revive yeah, the 10-mile stretch of the Kent and East Sussex Railway between Tenterden and Bodium. Bod- um, Bodium. Bodium. Tenterden and... Now that's got a castle. The no, waiting no. room has been turned into a museum of photographs and other historical material relating to the line and beside the road to Rolvenden. We're just... Well, we're just passing well, you need that. Over. Where is that centre? Where, where is it that, that they, um, they have their the displays? Now, uh, at Rolvenden Station. It's a wonderful collection of old... Do engines. you want me to go to Rolvenden Station? Rolvenden Station, I think, please. Can so we go near, near Rolvenden Station? Station? I can see and, it. Yeah. Rolvenden just down the road. Do you want road. us to land there? Yes, please, if right, you we, would. We're on our way. We'll be there in... Hang on, let me see. Is it a minute, Keith? <laughs> A minute. Is that at the end of the line, do you, th- do you think, Susie? Can you well, see the this railway going in further than that? Yeah. We've got Rolverden here. Look, it goes on into Tenterden. Yes, and then it seems the to end. That's yeah. 
Susie, I think oh. we're, I think we're going to keep you going to Tenterden to the end of the line there. Okay, we'll go to the end of the line, Keith. Forget that. Scrap that. We're going to Tenterden. <laughs> going to Tenterden. That's Sorry. okay. There's a really beautiful little steam train down here just going by us. That is fantastic. Great timing. Perfect day. Follow that train. Follow it. Follow, follow it. It's heading yeah, the right way. Maybe it will go to the. Wherever it stops is the end exactly. of the line. Well, yeah. We'll, we'll follow it into Tenterden and uh, see if there's something. Might it be something on End the train? End of the line for KES. We think we found that intended. Maybe. Oh, we can hear its whistle here. Oh, oh yeah, we heard it. <laughs> Ask Harry for Queen Vic's um, Windsor. Anything there more, more about it? Um, what do you think about Harry? Who's Harry? The waiting room has been turned into a museum of photographs. Tenderton's little station at the end of Station Road. That, all that the sounds cars like... I think it does sound on. like it, doesn't it? They haven't got names. It, six, six, two. Ask Harry for Queen Vic's Windsor. Could there be a photograph there of... We'll go, and it could okay. be labelled number 13. We're, we're going to... Well, we're let's not get ahead of ourselves. <laughs> um, and we're just going that's towards great. Tenterton Station. Who is... Who or what is Queen Vic's Windsor? Can you Windsor? give me some authority to land, chaps? Do you want me to go down and land? Yes, please. Yes, please. If you land would, if line. you would. And right, we're looking well, for... I'm at the station now. It's at, you're at the station. It's at the end of Station Road. That's right. Look here, we've got a, we've got a I'm train landing. up here. I'm landing. I can see some sort of Thomas the Tank Engine uh, kids steam engines and obviously lots of old carriages and so on. That's great. We want anything to do with Queen Vic's Windsor. Ask and Harry. Who ask is Harry? Ask Harry. Harry for Queen Vic's Queen Windsor. Vic. Who is Harry? Ask anyone if they, no, if, if they know who Harry oh, is. <laughs> Maybe there's another book on Kent somewhere. Um, Queen Vic's Windsor. What, what, Queen Victoria's what about Windsor? Queen Vic? Have I got to find something that's Queen Victoria? Just landed by the village forge on the left-hand side over there. That's the forge. All right, here we've got a more detailed and map. Of, uh, let's have a look. We're just Tenterden. going to look at... Um, just watching you on the okay, sky, Regis, Susie. Exactly. Yes, we can see, your see where you are. So I'm going to make a move for you now. Let's uh, to gate over here. We need to get onto the station. So we have to go through um, a sort of funfair area. It was an old, old theme uh, funfair here. How do we get to the station? I don't know if it's... Let's see if we can go through this way. I wonder if Harry would be uh, short for uh, Henry, as in like Prince Harry. Can we nip Prince through Henry. here? So where do we find? Ask Queen Vic. Queen Vic. Oh, the train is about Smoke twenty seconds. Should we watch it come in? Yeah. Um. Right, here's the train coming in. Let me just lean over here. Can you see properly? And um, see if there's any names on the carriages for you or anything like that. Oh yeah, maybe that's something like that. Let's have a look. Hurry up, train, hurry up, hurry up. Maybe a any sort of name on the station. Perhaps it's a locomotive now. Um, Is it the name of the train? Well, yeah, what's the, the name of the train? The train's called Rolvenden. <laughs> and uh, <laughs> there's no surprise there. Car number 73. They're Pullman carriages, car number 349. Any of those relevant to Queen Victoria? I don't know. Yeah, or maybe car let's number keep 69. Going down the uh, there's the one called 13. And then there's Barbara number at the 13. end. Barbara, Barbara. Barbara Windsor. Barbara Windsor, yes. Barbara Windsor, yes. fantastic. Yes, yes, yes. Who runs the Queen Vic in EastEnders. Of course. Wonderful. Yeah. You, you too highbrow, you guys. No, but maybe, <laughs> maybe... What do you want to do, shall I? Is it, the um, name, is it the name of a coach? Which, it's the name of a carriage. Of a carriage. Maybe go inside and it'll be seat number 13. Can you get in there and... and right, seat, 13. seat 13. I'll have to go through. It. I understand. I can't get through that way, so we've got to wait and go through here. Do I have to open this gate? Do you need a ticket? Will this kind man open the gate for me? Lovely. Good work. Ask him. Thank you very much. He's just opening the gate. Can I run through? Oh, yeah. 13. Right, we're, 13. we're through. We're through. Thank you very much. Thanks for waiting. Right, so you want me to go on to Barbara's coach? Yes, please. Yes, please. How do we get in? Quickly. Ask Harry. Is there anyone called Harry there? Is there a conductor Harry. or...? Are you Harry? I'm Harry, yes. Oh, fantastic! Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, Hello, fantastic. Harry. How are you doing? Hello, Susie. Very I'm well, looking thank for you. a clue. Yes. Have I got to go on, on to Barbara? Barbara? On to the coach, Barbara? Yes, you have. Yes, yes, come okay. this way. If you much. would. Oh, look, Harry's running with me. Thanks, Harry. Can you help? I'm going Ask on to, him to I'm show going you where seat 13 is. Thank you very is. much. Come on, boys, on you get. OK, on I'm going you go. on to the coach. Now, what am I looking for? Oh, hang on a minute. Hello, everybody. Sorry to disturb your, um, your dinner, but we're looking for a clue. <laughs> what are you yes. looking for? What, what are you looking for? 13. <laughs> you wanted to go to seat 13? Yes, go to seat 13. Who's in seat 13? It could be your lucky or unlucky day. I'm not quite sure which one. <laughs> Hello, <laughs> what's your name? Debbie Greaves. Debbie? I'm, I'm looking for a clue and I think, I'm wondering whether you might be sitting on it. Would you like to see? Could, could you stand up? Could I have a look? Sorry about this. Can you imagine having your dinner and then someone charging in and asking you to get out your seat? 
quite, quite rude. Nothing on the seat. Thank you. You can sit down again. Get the clue. Anything, you see, do you, you notice it? anything it's... here at all? Oh. <laughs> I'm looking on the table. Oh, oh, you haven't used your serviette. I should have known. I should have known. I've got it. I've got it. Hang on. Yes, oh, right, Susie. Right, Susie. Right, Susie. Right, Susie. Are Let's you go. ready? We are okay. ready. They're well bred by the church in the wood. When the family uh, Swede are racing, I drink for Jerry. They're well bred by the church in the wood. You better get back to the helicopter. Thank yeah. you so when much, When the family Swedai, Swedai, Swedai are racing, I'd root for Jerry. They're well day. bred by the much. church in the wood. Well bred by the church in the wood. Let's have a look. I'm going to look up the family um, name. Now, you've, just to tell you, you've got another two hundred pounds. That's three hundred altogether, much. and Bye you're everyone. a minute ahead. So we have still got time in hand. Well bred by the church in the wood. I'm going to look for a book on churches in Kent. We've got to go before the train comes back out again, otherwise we'll be stuck on this side, won't we, Guy? Yep. Yep. Do you want to try the um, Encyclopedia Britannica? Why don't you try the CD on Swede Eye? I might try be. the surname in well, there. Well, the church in the woods. Gosh. Church in the woods. We need to get Susie heading for a church one would suspect in the woods. Well, St Michael's is. Now, where's Keith? Through here, isn't he? Should be able to hear he is. Ready and willing as ever. In about 20 seconds, we'll either. be in the helicopter and need to know where you'd like to We can't give you a direction just yet. We're looking up churches. They're Church. well bred. Now think of well bred. Well bred. Family Swede. Oh, the Family Swede is, is a family um, of it's hoofed mammals we're looking for. Um, well, that would fit in with the breeding. Yeah, OK. Tell us more um, They are. Um, any, a, a Swede, S U I D, is any member of the Swede Eye hoofed mammals order. I'm in the helicopter, where do you want to go? Artiodactyla, including the wild uh, and domestic pigs. So I think we're looking for pigs. Pigs. They're pig breeding. Animals. We're looking for a pig we're farm, Susie, you'll be looking glad to know. What, sorry? Pigs. We, it could be That'd a pig be farm. Nice. We're, um, we're looking for a church. Um, it's all glamour, isn't it? Things I do. We're you. looking for a church in a wood, Susie, but we ha I can't give you a direction just yet. Oh. OK, well, we'll have to hover, I think, then. A wood church. I found wood, wood church, church on the map. We found wood church. That um, church. OK, well, now let's so, look up the um, if, you could, if you could head east. Can we go east, Due east please? Due east, east, please. Thanks, Keith. Not quite sure where they mean at the moment, wood church. Wood church. Wood just, church. Just due, due east. And, Daniel, what else is on the map? There? Um, rare, there's, there's, it says here, rare breed that, centre. That'll be it. That'll be so it. Something's, going, something's being bred um, bred. Uh, in, in wood church. Susie, you're following the course of the, the B2067. Do you B2067. have that on your map? I'm just going to say goodbye to the station. Look at it in all its here glory. Here the sky router. There's yeah. B2067, then we've got wood church and here. Wood church, I have B2 it in here, page 125. Um, Neil, what did you find out about this? Yeah, uh, well, he's going to be looking for pigs. And pigs. there'll be a pig race a going pig Oh, race. no, pig you've got to be joking. Um, hey. Yes, we're looking, we're looking <laughs> for a rare breed of pig. <laughs> You're looking, looking for this, You're going to be racing with you pigs. Dermot are in trouble. I hope you've got your wellies. And if you can find a pig called Jerry, that would be a even better. A pig bad. called Jerry. Should we find out more about Woodchurch? We're, we're heading to Woodchurch, and I'm looking for a pig Church. called Woodchurch. Jerry. Woodchurch. Um, ah. Are you really serious? Um, it was Jerry, completely serious. Daniel, listen, De oh, Jerry sorry. was ginger spice, and root is part of a ginger plant. I ginger root? Something. Ooh. Something spicy, something ginger. Ginger. Root, well, a I Red mean, coloured pig, they're, maybe? They're, 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 Pigs root for things. They they they, yeah. they, they oh. find mushrooms. They find <laughs> truffles. <laughs> truffles. Exactly. Maybe. Truffles. Who knows? So let me get this clear then. We're going towards Woodchurch. You're going towards Woodchurch, towards Woodchurch and you're looking yes. for a. Um, and there's a rare breed a rare centre. Breed centre. Rare and that's centre. just sort of. So if you can see any pigs in a field. And or Highlands or Farm. The things I do for you. Can you see that on your map, Highlands Farm? Uh, Highland Farms. Let me have a little look. Highland Farms, Keith, you're looking oh, for. Oh, 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 oh. Rare Wood breed centre. I found it, but nothing. Anything about pigs there? Nothing about pigs. Rare breed centre. Oh, 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 I can see rare breed centre on my map. Oh yes, that's it. That's it. That's Excellent. It. Right yeah. now, it might be helpful so to find out where the pigs okay. would be. So do you want us to go land there? Yes. Yeah. Here's some piggies. We've got some pigs. Lovely little piggies waiting for you. What? Check you on the route. How far no, would you say you are important. away from it, Susan? Keith can't decide whether it's two minutes to go or one minute to go. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> no, no, because I mean, he always says, says this two be, minutes. This could make the difference. Uh -huh. It's like you on the, the sky router. You must be very close. We are. We've got about us. a minute to go now, and after a little bit of waffle, I think. So we shall oh, yeah. be landing in a minute. We, we were enjoying Gingerly the waffle. red. Here we go. We're going Here for a Tamworth go. pig. Oh, you found ah. something. Why, why the Tamworth? Because 
um, the Tamworth is gingery red. So we're looking for a Tamworth pig at the a rare breed pig. centre. A Tamworth pig, did you say? Yes. Uh, I'm it, not sure Jerry Halliwell will thank us. I don't that. think she'll thank us either. <laughs> it's, a it's gingery red with long legs, prick ears and a long snout. So, so no resemblance. She really went thank us for that. She really went thank us no, for that. Really that. Really. Uh -huh. Right, so... Um, <laughs> so I wonder what... Um, right, we so are now over at Woodchurch, I think. Yes. Excellent. Can you see anything that looks like a rare breed centre? Uh, well, we're just kind of scanning the area. It's just below yeah, Highlands Farm. Yeah, I can Farm. see it on the map, uh, Daniel and Neil. I'm just seeing if we can... Where do you think it is, Keith? Just a little bit further on after those trees. Well, yeah, can you I'll see those trees there? Yeah, yeah. Guy's just showing so I reckon us. Be a pig just on the other on. side Better of those. It. I'm not racing on a pig. Jeez, I'm not sitting on a pig and racing it. <laughs> no way. Yeah. Depends if they're rare or not. That yes. would be rare, wouldn't it, really? Okay, She's yes, racing. I think we're getting there, boys. I think I can see something Excellent. here. We're on to something. There's definitely pork in the distance. <laughs> Excellent. Any pigs ah. being put in the stalls? So shall we land here? Any sign of little miniature jockeys? Miniature jockeys. All yes, jockeys. Yes, please, if you're in agreement, you no, should. Um, I think to be... Do you think we should, we should, um, next to the Rare Breed Centre, the pigs might be going towards Huntswood because it's a hunt? Right, all I can see is sheep. Sheep, sheep and more sheep at the moment. I think we need the pigs, Need some you? pigs. Yeah. Uh, yeah. They look like there could be some pig styes maybe over there. Is there anyone to ask? Well, we haven't landed yet, but there's lots of children. Oh, there's a pig. Oh, yes, there's a ginger there's a pig. Ginger. Can you see them? There's a yeah. ginger, ginger pig. pig. Excellent. Yes. Can Excellent. you believe that? Head straight there. Yeah, 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 yeah. OK, so I'm going to leave my map behind when I jump out this time. Now, what have I got to do? I've got to go to the ginger pig. Yes. And then what? what um, I'm racing. Is there any harness or anything on it? Let's have a look. Like Thanks, Keith. Right then, we're uh, we're now running towards the rare breed centre, <laughs> and there's um, let's look ahead. Look at that. We've got a lovely welcome. Hello. Everybody's look, everybody's come out for the day. What a perfect day to come out and uh, have a look at ginger pigs. Hello, everybody. You haven't got your sandwiches with you, have you? That'll nope. probably get them over excited. No, so I haven't got my sandwiches with me. <laughs> <laughs> there's um lots of oh, oh, oh hang on a minute. There's there's some ginger pigs here with black spots on. Is that any good or not? Ah. No, they uh, no, no, it doesn't, doesn't no. seem to have, have spots. Ours, our want doesn't have any yes, we've got a, Plain, we've got a... oh, don't walk too close to the horse, it might boot well, us. We're thinking of pig, pig racing. Pig Excuse racing. Any, any evidence I don't of them, know, uh, let's have a look. Around. Pigs aren't really noted for their um, athletic two... abilities, are they? Is there anybody around there's at two... all you can ask? Yes, there's lots. I've gone the wrong way, haven't I? Um, and if you see any pigs sprinting pigs past you, that'll probably be the here race. Here, on the left-hand side. Hang on, Ask hang on. You have a look at those on. pigs and I'm just going to run around because I've gone the wrong way. Just a second. <laughs> She's good at that. No. She oh, no, have I got to go in here? She's winning ways. Shall I go in here? No, I'm in the pig... pig... pig what is house. It? Is that actually a breeding centre, is it? Um, it is, yes, it's a rare Pig sty. Uh, so it's all glam from Susan. I can't see anything in here, boys. Should I not... Should I be outside uh, uh, it? Outside, I think, for, for the I race, don't... if it's going yeah. to be anything. Well, they... Hang on a second. Are they having a race? Yes, they, they are. are. Yes. They're having a race. They are, they are but I don't think I can interrupt the race. So come out again. Come out again. <laughs> don't think I'm supposed to be in there. Are some racing pigs, Susie? Are they different pigs? Look, we're after um, this clue. Just jump on that pig and wrestle it to the ground. I don't believe this. <laughs> Is there anything... But there's a clue around its neck. No, maybe, you know what? We've like got that. to go in. I've, we've got to find where this clue is. Go get her in there. Get her in there. Inside, inside. inside. Uh, is it going to be inside? I'm so sorry about this, girls. She's, they are trying to keep the pigs away. Is it in here? Get that ginger pig. <laughs> uh, but let me tell you what I can see. There's some uh, yes, bales yeah. of straw. Um, right. Uh, there's, there's in like a tunnel where the pigs have been racing through. Okay. Fantastic. Go through the go, tunnel. What do you mean, go through the tunnel? <laughs> We're going through the tunnel. Is it big enough to Stay go there. through? Is it big enough to go through? Okay, I will. Oh no, hang on, I can't. There's a pig this. in it. I can't, there's a pig in it. <laughs> well, is, it is it ginger? <laughs> is it a ginger? Yes, pig? they're both ginger yeah, pigs. Grab, grab it. Go for it. Grab it. Um, okay, I'm going in. I'm going in. She's just gonna <laughs> kill us. <laughs> I'm in us. the tunnel with a pig. Um, oh, right. I've got Any, it. Anything about it? I've got it. You've got the clue. Stop the clock. Stop, 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 stop the clock. clock. <laughs> stop the clock. <laughs> right. Now I don't our believe apologies. this. <laughs> Are you composing your? Do you apology? know what? If you could see what I could see, you wouldn't be able to believe it. <laughs> Shall I tell you where it was exactly? Because I know you can't see this in the studio. Tell me. Do you know what I told you about the bales of straw? 
Well, yeah. it was a tunnel, and it was inside there on the roof of the tunnel. Ah. Thank you, Piggy. Oh. So it wasn't actually <laughs> on the pig. No. no. Right, well done. You've won £600 altogether so far, and you're still about 30 seconds ahead of the clock. But now, the, now the hard work really begins. Uh, right, do you want this clue? Well, Great, yeah, just, just, just before that, I just want to tell you that there are seven kinds of pigs around there, apparently. Seven rare breeds, the British oh. Saddleback, the Tamworth amongst them, the Gloucester Old Spot, mm -hmm. the Large Black, the British Lop and the Berkshire. Oh, and of course, the Middle White, which, uh, Susie, you might be interested to know, is a very sociable pig, a good conversationalist. Maybe you want to uh, look one up there, uh, have a bit of a chat. What, so I could have a sensible conversation with somebody, you mean? <laughs> <laughs> well, bring us back a bacon sandwich. Oh, don't, not going to repeat that don't here. That, no. Yeah. no. Right, clue time. Yes. Susie? OK, ready? Start the clock. Shirley's crossed to a small place where ship sailed. E.T. went home, but let's face it, we all end up in a box. OK, oh, Shirley's nice. crossed to a small place where Bye, ship everyone. sailed. E.T. E. went home, but let's face it, we all end up so, in a box. Right, Shirley's okay, crossed so to a small place. Where okay, are we you thinking? get up in the helicopter Into the and helicopter. we'll work out the next Little Shetland thing. pony there, bless him, and a little horse Shirley's called Shirley's Arthur at the end. To a small place Shirley list. Moore. Well, Shirley's crossed. Cross that. So we're looking for a, a. Yeah, we cross Shirley's more then. To a small place where ships right, bye sail. Everyone. What about the map? What's it bye everyone. On the way back to the helicopter. Great people there. That was really enjoyable. Canal? Uh, no, they don't. Well. Canal, always a possibility. I'm likely to be a ship, though. I, mean, no. I know the What about Royal Milk? No. But a long time ago, I think the marshes were. Um, I mean, the sea might have come all the way up here. Oh, she's crossing. Crossing Shirley Moor, you think Shirley's crossed to a small place? So, small where should we go? Hello? The vineyard. Um, right, Susie hello. needs to know where you wanted to go. Uh, we're still working on it, Susie. Oh, um, you're slipping. To a small place for ships. Where ships are small. Bye, everyone. I had to go in a little pig race, Keith. Yeah, you're impressed with that, aren't you? I can tell. Right, then, we're at Woodchurch. So we're just sort of hovering at the moment. OK, yes, I think you're... Scaring well, some sheep. If you could head slowly south, because we think we're, we're going to be going to Shirley Moor. OK, we, we're sort of heading towards Shirley Moor, please, Keith. OK. Yeah. Let's pick you up on our going sky south. router there. It's your airborne, at least. So you've got a little, uh, a tiny road that we're going to sort of possibly follow down. And there we go, there's the rare breed centre that we're just leaving at Woodchurch. Yes, well, Maybe exactly. we need see, to look in sort these, of... These, um, these parts have been drained over the years. Mm. It might not necessarily... Remember, these, they're fiendish, these clues. Perhaps we need to look at um, books that are, are particularly on Kent's history rather than yeah. actual place names. I think it's, it's going to be a place name, name Neil. So we've got That's some beautiful countryside so. with the sun shining on this glorious sunny day. Now then, what's your line of thought, Daniel? Uh, line of thought is... Um, ah... We're looking for anything with the name small in it, or, or anything to do uh, well, that's with... A, that's up to us. Ship. I know it's up to us. <laughs> ah. Steady Let's on. tell Susie. Small. Hold on, I'll just look up. Yeah. I'll just Basically, look up that small height Why small? Oh. Uh, because, it's because it's a small place where ships sailed. I was thinking so like maybe... little something. Sm or? Well, we've got small hive, but it, I'm, I'm not sure... Mm. Let's look up Small Hyde. I'm looking for right, a Right, well, we, we're help. just going south as you asked, but obviously, if you could give us a. Yes, of course, more yeah. Specific if you could clue. sort of uh, hover around Sher Shirley Moor while we. Yeah, we're on Shirley Moor now. That's great. So we don't mess about here, you know, our Keith. So we're hovering over Shirley Where's Moor. That book of Kent? I've There's. Got uh, Let's try Small Hyde in there. I will. find anything about Nothing ships. Nothing resembling anything small, particularly around here. <coughs> well, we're a bit. To puzzle Susie because it refers to ships and of course you're rather inland. Well, we're completely inland. Yeah. I'm just looking on my map to see if I can find anything here just to uh, to help you out. Thinking about ships, Keith, and water, I don't know whether there's anything oh, well, you know of. Heading north from Wittersham, you cross the levels to Smallhive, the ancient harbour of, of Tenterden. Yes, um, Susie. So Smallhithe yes. was the harbour. Uh, would you say? Would you head uh, head towards Smallhithe, please? Smallhithe. Yes, it was an ancient harbour, so we think that. Um, so we're going right. Okay. Well, keep going. What, I can what else see. is in there, Daniel? Uh, like Appledore, it was a shipbuilding centre. Ah. Henry 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 yeah. VIII visited it in 1538 to inspect one of his warships under construction there. Right. Well, where 
off off to there now, so we're on our way towards Small Hive. Let's have a look at the rest. It's amazing how much they are you um, sure you're not sending me there? How far mm. back the yeah. sea has gone. If that used to be on the coast. Sorry, Susie. Are you sure you're not sending me there because there's a vineyard there again? <laughs> <laughs> They've rather got the taste for it, haven't they? Et went home. Et went home. Well, Et um, phoned so home. Didn't how long do you think? Let's face it, we all end up there. Oh. Oh. One minute. Very Rick. decisive. Um, yeah. Oh, but yes. let's face it, we all end up in a box. Well, we are going to arrive in one here. minute. It's, it's now visited for the Ellen anything. Terry Museum. Um, Ellen Terry. Ellen Terry. Et. Got, uh, Et. Ellen Terry. Uh, that we're going to the, we want you to go to the Ellen Terry Museum. This, Ellen Terry Museum. This, it's, it's a timber-framed yeoman's house. So you're looking for a wooden-framed building. Wooden-framed building. Yeah, it's, it's built around 1480 for the harbour master. So a wooden-framed building and, and Ellen Terry. Yes. Now, she lived there. What's the, do you know what the building's called? Uh, it's called the Ellen Terry Museum. Ellen Terry, oh, museum, OK. Yeah. Right. Sure. Uh -huh. It's a small timber-framed house down by the old harbour. So, mm. we want to, as soon as I get there, it's a small hide. You want me to land as let's soon as possible? No, I well, let's find something about this museum. Yeah, you? I wonder if maybe that's... We're looking for a museum, house. Keith, which is here. Slightly so. Right, let me just check then. So, Neil... Yes. Uh, would you like us to land as close to the museum and yes, small please. hide as yes. possible? Yes, would, yeah. Yes. Right, we're going to do that. We're going to circle over... Hive. We're in small hive and it's a small very small. Hive place. Uh, um, it's very yeah, oh, Terry, here we are. Hang on, I can see it. Um, I found a I brochure. I can see it. I can see it. Got something. Um, the there's books. a really beautiful old um, oh, old building. Yes, it's, um, yes. Um, it's got uh, all the old beams at the front. There's a lady. We, uh, so yeah. should we land there? Yes, please. Right, we'll land, please, Keith, as soon as you can. That'll be great. Dame Ellen Terry was born in 1847, lived in Small Hive Place from 1899 until her death in 1928. Now, there's two different buildings here. There's two Oops. separate uh, buildings. When, that is, her, when her portrayal as Portia, Portia in, in Merchant of Venice, Venice launched her as a great actress. What do I look for when I'm in the museum, please? Uh, we're not too sure. Um, it says we all end up in a box, so we're thinking maybe a maybe a coffin or a box of some sort. Oh, it's all a bit morbid, that, isn't it? <coughs> what about Merchant Let's of Venice? Then, right. boxes in there? Going from uh, the field yes. now, we're running... Yeah, I've, I'm going to look up... There's a, it mentions gates. as well... In 1906, I've got two buildings in Ellen front of me here. Ellen the United States with American actor got, James Carew. I've got so a house. So what are you looking at? I'm going to look up James like Carew. Yeah. So yeah. I'm sort of in between the two. Are you in the museum yet, Susie? Go around to the house. Yes, I'm just running around to the front. Oh, okay. Hello, everybody thinks I'm We all barking. end up in a box. What um, could it be? Front of the house. Um, thinking just keep looking right here. here. We need something more about Ellen Terry. Now then. Hello. Hello, good afternoon. Now, am I in the Ellen Terry Museum? You are. I'm inside. Okay. I'm inside. I'm, I'm, I'm looking for some sort of box. Um, do you have got, have you got any... Do you want me to ask about a coffin? Hello? Hello, there's Do you want me to ask about a coffin or not? Um, and, um, have you gone off that? I don't think this is helping me at all. Um, with... We're just, I've just got a, a, a book on, on the museum here. I'm just seeing if it means anything. I'm, in, I'm inside the museum now. Thank you. Um, the room I'm in, there's, a, there's a dresser ah. on the left-hand side. There's a, a seat, two seats, actually, that um, are sort of... They are quite, got box. quite boxed in, the seats. It's got, um, I think we've got it, Susie. It's what? A, we're, you're looking for a theatrical makeup box. A theatrical yeah, makeup yes, box? Face it. She, yeah. yeah, she would use it to... Um, <laughs> have, we, have we got a picture of it here? Yes, we have indeed. What does it look like? Tell me. Box. It's a wicker box and it's, it's... It's open. Wicker box. And it's got sort of um, locks of hair and... Um, oh, I, a, a, I don't think it's... Where would it be in her... Hang on, how many rooms are there? Room? There's another room in here. I'm going into a small. different room. Um, I can see... I can see a box. Um, Hang on. Oh, it's like a sewing box. That's a sewing box. sewing box, that's it. Is that it? Is that it? Yes, that's it. Have a look inside it. It says, no, it's not made out of wicker, though. It's made out of wood. Uh, well, oh. there, there, there's both. There's a, a, a makeup box and a sewing box. If you could have, have a look in the Actually, sewing box, and if it's not there... And there's, there's a makeup basket. Anything. It just says, do or not touch. So it no, they're both in, the, in what's called the Terry Room. Ter that must be the room you're in. Am I, is this the Terry Room? Can you find, can you find another I box? am in the Terry Room. Yes. OK, then it's a makeup for basket. Box. A makeup basket, Death we think. Death Mask of Ellen Terry yes. box. Oh, have a look in that. OK, OK, hang on. 
Oh, wow. Well, Excuse me. I have got the clue. It's isn't it, it's so new. You've got it. I've you got, got it. the clue. Yes, Read it out. Read it out. I have. It's quite, it's quite let's bizarre. Let's go. Let's go. Okay, Last listen. One. Tread the boards, then take a seat with Arthur's man. Tread the boards, then take a seat with Arthur's man. Tread the boards, then take a seat with Arthur's man. Who is Arthur's man? You've got four minutes left to find Arthur. this. Thank you very <coughs> much. You've got a thousand pounds. This is worth another thousand. Oh, now, of course, this is the Hello. fifth clue, and Susie's not taking off again. It's I'm somewhere nearby. So, so sorry. Tread the boards. Take a seat with Arthur's man. Tread the boards. Would that be like a deck? Tre well, tread the boards. No, is no, no. It's yeah, lovely, it's you know. It's yeah. theatre. Yeah. do. It's acting. Is there a small so, theatre um, or anything? A stage. Um, a stage. A stage. Let's look at I this. mean, would it be in the same town? Can you tell me what you just said? Oh, um, sorry, Susie. Um, we're just, we're, we're just, we're just, house. we're, we're still I'm thinking. thinking. Yeah. Tread the board. Tread what, the what do you think that means? It means um, acting, so something to do with the theatre. Oh, acting. Well, maybe that's the um, and, and take Binoculars. a seat with Arthur's well, man. Well, maybe that's the. Um, was that not the actor that I, I read about? I think we the use these in the theatre, don't we? Is there? There's not a theatre in here. Oh, is there, there is a theatre in there here. Is a there is a theatre. Well, that's yes. head, head for the stage. You're not telling me. If you would. <laughs> not in here. Oh, where? Arthur's Sorry. Where, where is it? Three minutes left. In the garden. In the garden. Right, we should um, go to the garden. Man. Thank you very much, kind sir. There's a theatre. Are you following me, chaps? Yeah, in listen, the studio. Listen to Susie, Susie, Daniel Susie. Neal. Yes, yes. What? So, hello. Hello. Hi. Hello. Uh, uh, now you found this stage. Have you found the stage yet? I'm looking for the stage. I think it. I think it must be around here. It, it, it's the other building that I was talking about when we landed. Do you remember I said there was two? Well, this is the other one. Yes, this looks like a. This looks like a stage. stage. Right, OK. Stage. This is, yes, this is you the theatre the club. Stage. This is the Ellen Terry theatre Now, is there a club. seat? Oh, Take so a I'm seat here. with Arthur's man. Can you see uh, uh, any... Arthur's other... seat, was it, was it to do with... Arthur's I doubt it. No. <laughs> um, do you want me to that... look for now? Do you want me to, do you want me to go inside? <laughs> uh, yes, please. And um, chairs, anything, uh, any there's chairs? There's some old chairs. Oh, well, there's lots of chairs. And anything... there, they've all got names on them. Like King Arthur's uh, man, no, Merlin. They've got names on them. Could you look for a name, Arthur? Point. The name Arthur. Arthur on it, please. Yeah, please. Think about King Arthur, Merlin or Excalibur. I'm looking at Oh, that's a good idea, yep. Either Arthur or any Arthurian name, like... Um, to, where would I find that? Chris, Susie, shout out some Lady of those names Elizabeth, for us. Could you call out the names? Gabrielle. Gabrielle. Nelly. Um, hang on, let's start again here. H. Walkender. Janet Terry. Arthur's man. Lewis. Anything in there. Sybil Thorndike. Lewis Casson. Garden and Barn Charles Theater. State. Diana Wilson. Um, John Gilgood. 90 oh, seconds. John Gilgood. Oh. John Gilgood. Was he in John the Gilgood. film? John Gilgood. Arthur. John Gilgood. Arthur. Was he in Arthur? The film. The film. Oh, he was the butler. He won an Oscar for uh, it. Yes, yes, yes. Look under there. Look under Who's there. Who's the butler in, in Arthur? Hang on, I'm looking, Gilgood. I'm Gilgood. looking under the chair. I'm looking under the chair. You've got the chair. You've got, you got, 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 got the clue. Yes! Fantastic. You've done it. Well done. <laughs> Congratulations. Well done, guys. Well done. <laughs> Thank you very Congratulations. much. Congratulations. You cracked it. Well done, Susie. Well done. Susie yet again did all the hard work. Yeah. Arthur's man. Oh, Gosh. Yeah, You're getting Arthur's seat. It was <laughs> Arthur. I'm just thinking You're of the thinking journey Edinburgh, home. Right? <laughs> Excuse me. <gasps> Have you got permission to be here? This is the Ellen Terry Theatre, you know. Have oh, you got I'm permission so to be in sorry. here? I'm so sorry. Hello. 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 Who are you? I'm... <laughs> Donald oh, Sindon, yes, hello. Uh, and I'm the patron of the uh, Ellen Terry Barn Theatre Society. Fabulous. Well, and that's it's fascinating. It's the most intimate little theatre you've ever liked to come across. Can I shake your hand? I love it. Mm. Thank Even you. nicer. Oh, thank you, I'm honoured. Thank uh, you so much for that, Sir Donald. That's pretty... And what about that? Daniel, Neil, congratulations. Thank, thank you very you, much, Susie. Absolutely Thanks very much. Absolutely clue solving. That was really fast and unbelievable. Thank and you it, for your footwork as well. That's brilliant. Yeah, I think you should go back to that vineyard for a well-earned yeah. drink. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, all that's left for me to do is to uh, hand over, with great pleasure, the £2,000 oh, prize. Well done, you Thank two. Thank you very Thank much you. indeed. That's marvelous. terrific. <laughs> <laughs> I hope you had Pleasure. a lot of fun. It yes, was great certainly did, yeah, it was great Thank fun. you very much. Yeah, Thank, Thank you. Thanks. Cheers, Dermot. Thank you. Well, from Neil and Daniel and me and Susie, of course, until the next time Treasure Hunt takes to the air, it's goodbye. See you next goodbye. time. Bye. And the next Treasure Hunt is tomorrow on BBC Two, same time, six o'clock. In a moment, the Ferengi are showing a keen interest in Troy's mother, and that's bad news for the next generation of Star Trek. <laughs>